Murray meant so much to everyone because he was the kind of the, the way, the entry point for so many of us into this sport and to understand it and to be uh, drawn towards it. And so Murray's voice did all those things. He was, uh, he was like the sirens, you know, calling us <laughs> and uh, into the television set as he, he got excited. Were there any favourite moments? That you, uh, from Murray yeah. Walker, yeah. I mean, there were so there many, was, but, the one. but the one that I think most people remember is that I've got to stop because I've got a lump in my throat. But of course, everyone heard that, but I didn't hear that till I got back to the UK. I won the championship in '96. Of course, I'm in the car, so I didn't hear the commentary. Um, but uh, it's obviously been repeated quite a lot. And of course, it, it is an emotional moment when you become a world champion. And for Murray to say that, it meant a lot. And um, you know, it's a terrific little uh, sign-off, little signature, Murray signature on uh, my championship. So I'm very happy about it. It's so emotional. Even just hearing you say it makes yeah. me feel emotional. It's you know. Well, it's it's sport, isn't it? I mean, yeah. sport is you know so much passion and energy goes into these things. And and to actually finally cross the line. I mean, we're, we're talking about this in the middle of the Olympics, and you see how much people put into these achievements or, or challenges. I think he was particularly uh, moved because, you know, he'd, he'd known my dad and he'd watched my dad and he knew the whole story, so there was a little, little bit of that. What is it about Murray Walker that set him apart from everyone else when it comes to commentary and what sort of legacy do you think he's going to leave behind to commentators and presenters in the future? I think, I think it's a set of standards um, which is going to be very difficult to emulate or in any way you know, I don't think anyone should try and copy Murray because it's, you've got to be yourself, and he was himself. And he transmitted this love and passion uh, in a way that sometimes tripped himself up because of his enthusiasm, but that, that endeared us to him, you know. So uh, it was a special... He's put his stamp on a whole era of Formula One and, and other motorsport formulas, and, uh, and so it'll, it'll, stand, it'll always be there, which is great.